Ten English phrases for talking about the future, from EspressoEnglish.net. Number one, it will happen any minute now. It will happen any day now. Use this phrase to say that an event is definitely going to happen very soon, but it is not known exactly when. For example, the doctors say she could have the baby any day now. Number two, it's just around the corner. Just around the corner means that something will happen soon, and you do know exactly when. For example, in the beginning of December, you could say that Christmas is just around the corner. Number three, we're planning to move in the near future. In the near future also means soon. Usually, without knowing exactly when, but this phrase doesn't have the same sense of immediacy as any minute now or any day now. In the near future, usually means a few weeks or months in the future. Number four, it will happen in our lifetime. It won't happen in our lifetime. In our lifetime means in the next fifty to sixty years. For example, you could say, "Medicine is progressing very fast. I think a cure for cancer will be developed in our lifetime." Number five, it's a sign of things to come. It's a taste of things to come. Use this phrase when something happens that indicates how things will be in the future. For example, if the economy is starting to get worse and worse, you could say, "Three people I know have lost their jobs recently. This is a sign of things to come," meaning that you believe many more people will lose their jobs in the future. Number six. I'm counting the days until. Use this phrase when you are anxiously awaiting a future event. You want it to happen soon. For example, I'm counting down the days until my trip to the Caribbean. Number seven. Sooner or later, it's bound to happen eventually. Use these phrases to say that something will definitely happen sometime in the future. It may be soon, or it may be far in the future. Number eight. I'll get around to it. Use this phrase to say that you will do something in the future when you have the time. It is usually used for activities that are not especially urgent. Number nine. I'll do it right away. I'll get right on it. Use these phrases to say that you will do something in the future as soon as possible. These expressions are used for urgent tasks. Number ten. Time will tell. Use this phrase to say that a situation is currently uncertain. But in the future, it will become clear. For example, if you are discussing whether or not the country's new president is good, you could say, "Time will tell," to express that the answer will be revealed over the coming months and years. Thanks for watching English tips from Espresso English. If you liked this video, please share it.